Master Dolsim, I've come to ask you to teach me in the ways of yoga. For what purpose do you wish to know? My purpose is to become stronger and to protect our people as you do. The path of yoga is one of harmony, not violence. Its power is not in strength, but understanding. I... I didn't mean... Maybe I could. Thank you, wise master. Then we... Ah, so there you are. Are you the Dalsim? One of the seven yoga masters in the world you gotta meet at least once? That's what the net calls you. Master? The net? Just who are you? Master Dolsim is busy. Sorry, I definitely understand. I haven't much time either. Well, I would be extremely appreciative if you could teach me the skill of yoga. Shouldn't take too long. I just need you to indulge me in a single match. Master. And why is it that you seek to improve your skill? I can't say. But please, I need to become stronger or else. Please. Hmm. Understood. Let's fight. Beautiful. Yoga. I thought that if I saw you fight at least once, I'd learn most, if not all of it. I suppose with yoga, there's no shortcut, eh? Master. No, there isn't. Yoga isn't something you can learn in a short span of time. I thought as much. Well, at least I got to fight someone as extraordinarily skilled as you. It was a good experience. One more thing. I'm sure you know many people. Have you seen this person? No. I see. Thank you, then. Take care. Were you okay with that? To show a person like him your skills in the way of yoga? You shouldn't worry. He seeks the skills to do good, just as you. He may not have mastered the skills, but if he gained something from fighting with me which will help him, then good will come of it. Hmm. This is what is released in tandem with prayer to the god Agni, the very basics of yoga. What an odd thing you are doing! You are... He... he's floating! Is that yoga? <laughs> Does this really look like yoga to you? Your disciple has a lot to learn! I never thought I would encounter you at a place like this. Last killing time, I sensed interesting people here, so here I am! And by the way, why would you have a disciple like him? His skill is very poor, and he'll only become an obstacle to your own training. I believe in him. And I want to spread the knowledge of yoga to help and support others. The improvement of my own skills are secondary. My ultimate goal is to harmonize everything in the universe, even if it takes a lifetime. I believe that my actions in and of themselves will inevitably set me upon the right path. <laughs> Not to completely master the skill, but instead to spread the skill. I see you haven't changed at all. Are you leaving already? I'm sensing another interesting person around here somewhere. You should make me a tasty curry next time. Be well! Master Dawson, who was that? He is a long-lived hermit. A master of Senjutsu. Yoga! <laughs> no, I can't. Impatience is muddling your mind. Calm yourself. Excuse me, can I talk to you? Hmm? Hello, my name is Rainbow Mika, and I belong to the Iwashigahama Japan Women's Pro Wrestling. Could you teach me how to breathe fire, like what you did just now? Wrestling? That's right. That's
That skill would be perfect! If I did that in the ring, the crowd would go wild and... You needn't say any more. I understand your passion. Why don't you learn it by fighting with me? Thank you so much for your time! Mastering yoga is not easy, so don't be discouraged. Although you can't yet breathe fire, your passion will ignite the flame in the future. And when it does, it will also ignite everyone. Passion will ignite? I think I... I think I learned something! Thank you! Thank you for teaching me, sir! <sighs> hmm. It was an excellent fire. But it wasn't as big as yours, Master Dawson. The size of the flame is not what is important. You are training your mind. Skill will only be a guide. When you care for someone, your mind is what becomes the flame. It also becomes the power to create harmony. To help you create that harmony, I will do all that I can for as long as it takes. Master Dawson!